Congratulations, another perfect qualification. All guys uh, are qualified and I think we can be happy with the jumps. Yes, I think this training was the best training on this summer Grand Prix. So everybody shows good jumps, but still there is some reserves. Uh, how was the training in Hintersarten? Are you 100% satisfied with the, with the training in Hintersarten? I'm never 100% <laughs> satisfied, but I was satisfied in this training, so we had good co conditions for train. We made some special training for the in-run speed, and today the, the speed was already better, so we are, on this case we are on a good way. Yes. Uh, well, I heard that also Andrzej Stenkawa came, especially for the training, yes? Yes, Andrzej was coming for the training to Hinterzalten because he uh, goes to holiday next week so and then we decided that he come to for the training and train with us and he was also on good level so it's okay. Uh, the guys also had some free time. I heard that you even invited them for grill, is it true? <laughs> <laughs> yes, we make some small barbecue in my home so I arranged something and yeah, that was uh, quite fun. And I think for athletes and for the trainer staff, it was really nice to have something like this. And uh, w what can you say about today's conditions? Was it difficult with the wind and uh, rain? No, not really. So minimal changes of the wind, but not big problems. So it was quite, quite equal for everybody and it was no, not disturbing wind or rain. Uh, what's new with Stefan Hula? He was not participating in Hintersarten. Is he on vacation? No, he's in home train and he's on the camp next week with uh, Robert Matteo. And he will prepare for Hakuba, I think, for the Summer Grand Prix. So he's in training. And uh, when will you make the decision concerning the team, the, the A team for the winter? Uh, for sure not before end of Tchaikovsky because we have still these competitions and we have to send some athletes there and uh, I don't know yet the time but not so early it's hard to choose the team <laughs> it's really hard because so many good jumpers now and it's really hard I'm a, I don't want to have the decision too early okay and today we've seen that at least three or even four guys can jump at the top level do you think that tomorrow more than just Maciej and Kamil can fight for the podium? No, it's hard to say. So training is training, competition is competition. But today David shows a really good performance, really good. So he was, his jumps was really nice to show. Only telemark, bit problem, but this was also really long jump. So and here it's really hard to make the telemark. But yeah, maybe we have one more option for the podium. Yeah, I hope so. And how, how do you? How does the Polish team do that? Uh, there are no disqualifications so far. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're working also here on high level, so we always uh, control the the, the the system, the, the suits, and everything on uh, before every competition. And when you uh, control everything, then it's clear there is no no disqualifications. I noticed that only German team and Polish team arrive at the hill very late, like 20 minutes before the training. Uh, it's, this is also something new that you make the warm-up already in the hotel. Yes, we always looking for some quiet place for the warm-up. Sometimes in hotel, sometimes somewhere out outside. So it's changed always a bit, but not too near on the hill because uh, we need our time for concentration. Do you also have some secrets in the warm-up metal methods? Yeah, for sure. <laughs> That's why we do it outside. <laughs> okay, thank you very much and good luck tomorrow. Yeah, thank you.